Welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong 94. I'm your host, Ultra Director Jester. This is episode 5, and we're about halfway done with this game. Sorry, updates have been a little bit slow lately, but who cares about that? Let's just get started with the next stage, because it's a little bit of a long one this time. So let's go! This first stage here kind of shows off the gimmick we saw in the last vignette. These, uh, hammers that break away blocks. Very straightforward, uh, this one. Incredibly straightforward. You gotta get the second hammer to refill, because you won't have enough time to climb the ladder and get the hammer, and then break the rest of these blocks. Once you do that, you can grab the key, and you're done with the level. These sand blocks drop you down. And got all three items, too. Just a nice little easy warm-up. We've been gone a little bit. And we're gonna get free one-ups as, as a reward, I guess. Hope it's a good one. Oh, it, uh, ah. Oh well, one's better than none. Next one. This one's a pretty tricky one. So whoa, whoa! Start by not going to. Oh, Mario just slid across the floor like he was going crazy. Goddamn. Yeah, get a one up, lose a one up. Oh well. Alright, so first thing we'll do is we will make our way up to these guys. They're really annoying, so I'm going to kill them. Well, maybe not. What we do is take this hammer, run over here, and kind of drop down over here. Move quickly, move quickly. This guy just throws bones like, like, nonsense. So be careful of that guy. Huh. <sighs> And then once you clear that away, stage is over. A lot of these stages are starting to get a lot more complex, a lot more open, but you're gonna see that they're still pretty easy, if you know what you're doing. Alright. This next one here, we'll drop down here. Put that right there. And we'll head over here. Get this. Put that. Uh, yeah, right here, why not? And try not to die, this is... That guy really got in my way, he really fucked that up for me. God damn it. <laughs> I'll try this again. Put that there. Let's go from the other side this time. And put that here, because that switch is very important. So take that, yank that, so that'll go down. And we got the key here. And that's the end of that level. 220 seconds. That's probably to have enough time to get all the items, too, but that only gets us free one-ups. And I think we're doing pretty good on lives so far. I, I guarantee we're gonna reach 99 by the end of this. And here's our first donkey stage. He's back to smashing things and throwing stuff at us from the ceiling. Rude git. Getting hard to work. Alright. It's all about timing? Ah. Gotta go for the next cycle. There we go. He's gotta reach the end, and there you go. I get really stressful. Especially when you're on the ladder at the wrong time. These time ladders are a killer. Time for another vignette, something we've been doing for a while now. Yeah, I bet you didn't know you could do that. But I guess that's the game reminding you that you can do that. And a few one-ups for the road. Let's keep going! This next stage is probably the most difficult. And ironically, the shortest one. It's only one screen. But you got a hundred seconds to do this correctly. First thing you do here is take these guys up and toss them off, because they're just going to be in your way. And take this guy and throw him in this little handy... Whoop. Not there. No. God damn. Anyway, like I said, you want to take this guy and kind of dump him down... Ah, fucking shit! Alright, there. Fine. He's in that pit now. Maybe I haven't got to the hardest part yet. Essentially, we kind of throw this key over there, head back up across, and then grab it in time to open the door. So when it's pulling away, then throw it, and then it's time to haul ass, and I've fucked it up. I practiced this twice on my 3DS, and uh, playing it on an emulator is 
Not as easy. Gotta tell you what, there is some latency issues. And I'm just not doing too well. And just like that, we've got a little bit more than halfway to go on time. I'm not gonna get a good score here. There we go, that's a good one. And run across, down the ladder, got it, there you go. Could have done that a lot more elegantly, but who needs elegance when you're making progress? I don't know, I guess both would be nice. Alright, next stage. Got these uh, loud guys, I'm gonna knock this guy out immediately. And we'll drop down here. Break this off first. Yep. Get rid of that guy. Looks like this flame is gonna give me some problems. The important thing is to hit that switch, though. Pull this lever, whatever you want to call it. It opens up the way to the door, the exit of the level. So we'll grab this, run as quickly as we can. Hopefully, uh, Donkey Kong RNG will be able to help you out. Make you go a little faster, but essentially you take this one, break over here, and there's the key, and let's go beat the level. Yay! 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 Just blazing right on through. As usual. Alright, next stage, um, this one could be a little tricky. Just, just a tiny bit. Don't really need to worry about doing this platforming, you just climb up the pyramid directly. These cannons are what you gotta really watch out for. Sometimes they'll fire one, sometimes they'll fire two. You just gotta kinda judge it and get expert timing. And then break both these with this hammer here! And now we climb it up again. Climb it up again. But luckily we don't need to deal with those cannons again because we can just take the key and just head on back down. Don't go too far so if you drop it and bang your head. It's easier to go up than it is to go down, obviously. There we go. Alright! Alright, now for the DK level. For this one, you just gotta reach the top. He's throwing barrels, so it makes you think maybe I gotta throw them back, but... Got! Hmm. Got a little bit too... Duh. Hit. Black! This is why I would not be a good uh, speedrunner. Third time to charm. Let's go. Yeah. Shit. Come on. Oh god, there's barrels everywhere. I don't even know what I'm doing. Yeah. 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 Aha. Whew. Yeah. I got it. Hey! Anyway. Again, another vignette. Something that we've already known that we can do from the beginning of the game. You pick up an enemy and throw another one, and that'll kill it. To who would have guessed? Nah, four lives exact, though. If I would have- if I would just wouldn't have been one second fast- faster, just one second, I could have gotten 61 lives. Fuck! Oh well, last lick. I'm not too upset. And this stage can certainly be confusing, and I've found that there's many ways to solve it, but here's my favorite. First you hit that, and you come up here, and you hit that. And you come up here, watch out for this little guy. Hit that, that opens up the way to the key. I think what they want you to do is they want you to head back through here, but fuck that. Throw it about right here. Do a handstand, hit that switch, that goes down, grab the key, and there you go. So now the weight of the door is open, and now you just gotta head back. So we get off here, and we'll jump. That happens, throw that, hit that switch, take the key, throw it up there, do that, come up here, throw the key again, and up we go again, get the key, let that guy drop, rock across, and we're about to make it in about 250 seconds, a little less than that, because I'm taking a slow-ass elevator down. But additionally, we got all three items now, so we're gonna get probably a slot machine or a... roulette wheel at the end of this. 246 seconds, that's not bad. Alright, let's hope we get those threes. 
Don't think we will, though. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, yeah! <laughs> that was lucky as shit. Next stage. This one is interesting entirely. You have to pretty much develop your own stage with these uh, switches here, I guess. So first one. Just about as high as we can throw this key. I like that. And this one, I don't think we'll go ahead and use the spring. That'll work. Yeah, got that. Oh, and for this one, again, just as high as we can throw, about right there. Yep. Uh -huh. The ladder taking us up to said key. Now we have left as a spring, which we can easily use. Just climb to this ledge. And there you go. Nothing to it. Okay, have practice, I promise. Just not on this platform. All right, penultimate stage. Another interesting one. If you want to explore the whole thing, you can get all three items, but uh, we're just looking for the key here. So first thing we'll do is wait for this uh, crab scorpion guy. And, no, it's scorpion. The scorpion guy to come by. But uh, one thing we're also gonna do. I don't want him to go by again because I forgot to hit this guy. Now, what do we do? What do we do with this thing? We put him right there. So then time goes out, right over here, hit the switch, so that the one on the left goes down, but not the one on the right. And it stays that way, giving us enough time to grab the key here. Use this for nothing, I'll just put this, uh... Right here, give him a... I'll uh, put him right here, give him a bit of a headache. Ha ha ha! There you go! That made pretty good time. I think they made up for the second bit of levels that we did. But alright, let's finish this off. Funny enough, in this one, DK is not throwing barrels, he's throwing, uh, little, uh, Anka Pharaoh dudes. Pharaoh heads, I guess. And, uh, this proves not to be the best idea, because that means that you can just pick up and throw them whenever they start moving. If I had a better control, I could to have some better input and take him out even faster. But still, not too difficult. If you don't try to do anything flashy, at least you'll be fine. Huh. And that's another one in the bag, folks. So that's 718. Wow. That's pretty good. I think I'm gonna... I think I might hit 70. 70 lives. All that vignette symbols is that next time on Donkey Kong 94, we're gonna be hopping onto an airplane. And... Yep. Ah! Alright, I got 71 lives. So we're gonna be all prepared next time when we head off into the skies on Let's Play Donkey Kong 94. Thanks for watching this. Really. <laughs>